The town of Homerville now recovering from a week of turmoil in its police department. Just days after its police chief was fired for improperly handling evidence, all of their police officers quit. And now the interim chief and the Clinch County Sheriff are at odds. As WALB News 10's Ashante Isaac reports, the Homerville Police Department could shut down. What started off as a team of 10 quickly dwindled down to zero when members of law enforcement quit following the appointment of interim chief James Hurden. They locked the keys in the car. They turned the keys halfway on, the radios on, and made the batteries go dead in all the cars. They broke into my office and stole the evidence room keys. I have not yet to locate. They took the drug dog. Unfortunately, from where I sit, that's theft by conversion. That's a felony. Herndon is making serious allegations against former Homerville Police Department officers. I tried to set up a meeting with the former officers today, but the one officer who showed up wouldn't talk. I will make a recommendation whether it's worth salvaging money-wise and what's best for the community and hire new officers or we just shut it down. But either way, that's a decision for the council. Orange County Sheriff Stephen Tinsley supports the police officers who quit, and he says the 10 deputies they have on staff will cover the county seat of Homerville. We're limited on our own manpower, but you can rest assured that the citizens of Clinch County will be protected regardless of what's going on until the city council and city manager decide what they're going to do. We're here to support them as well as all citizens of Clinch County. Due to the closeness of this community, residents do not want to be on camera. But a local EMS worker tells me that he doesn't feel safe working here anymore. Ashanti Isaac, WALB, your hometown news source.